Hi, I'm Andrew with Baker's Gas, and we're here today with the Lincoln Electric XLR respirator uh, filter system. So this is new to Lincoln Electric. Uh, they just came out with this unit. Um, it's, it's designed for uh, the welder, and it fits underneath a welding hood. So in this video, we're going to go over the ratings, we're going to go over the fit test, and I'm going to show you how to adjust straps, and then uh, talk about pricing and all the items that you can get with this thing. So let's open up the bag. So it comes in a nice resealable bag, so you can store this uh, filter back in the bag. It's got like a, uh, a zip lock seal on it. I'm going to pull it out of the bag. comes in a nice bag. It has instructions. has the filters. So in this, the first thing on this filter, it has a, a mask guard that pops off, and it just keeps its shape. Um, you could put that back on after every use, but it just keeps its shape because it's a pliable like plastic. So first things first, it comes with two filters. You can get these filters uh, replacement, and uh, how often should you replace them? I guess it depends on the environment that you're in. Um, if you're medical field, probably not as often as you would be um, in the welding field. So it is a P100, so it is a 99.97%. It pulls particulate out, um, and I will show you here how to replace these filters. So they just twist on, and there is a little chevron right there, right there on the top, and then it correlates with that chevron right there and you just line those up and then you just twist now it does it is kind of uh, at first it is kind of cumbersome to twist those in um, and you think you're gonna break the thing but they they are tight and they are sealed so they got a nice seal around the edges there and uh, they just pop in and you just twist oh, and it goes like that so another uh, feature on this unit is it's got this front uh, uh, I guess it's a holder for this valve here. So you twist it to unlock, pulls out, and then that, that valve right there. So when you're cleaning your filter or anything like that, you can pop that off to clean that. And it twists. They put some high vis or reflectors on there um, for job sites and things like that. So let's try this thing on here. So it kind of came up twisted here. There we go. All right. So it's got your, your halo cradle for your head, and then it's got the around the back of the neck strap. So I will So it goes on pretty smooth, and then to adjust, you just pull this strap and that strap, and it pulls it up to your face real nice and tight. And then to do the fit test, you hold the, these things will push in, so you squeeze them, and then you breathe in. And you can see it sucks in the nose piece, so it actually pulls all the air out of the mask and it fits it right to your face real tight. But boy, it, it is really comfortable to, to wear. Pull it back off so you can hear me. It's actually really comfortable, and uh, I don't get a lot of fog on my glasses, and it fits, fits very nicely. Um, so this, uh, this unit, we have them in stock. Um, it's going to run right around $28 for the mask itself, and then the replacement's coming at two pack, and they're about $15 for the replacement. So pretty inexpensive, and it's a good P100 uh, filter, and it fits underneath your uh, welding hood just fine here. Let's try that out. We'll put it underneath the, the welding hood. It's right underneath there and I mean I could still I still got visibility I can still see and it, it, it's pretty nice it's under there pretty tight um, it does kind of hit the front of the mask but I'm sure if you adjust your helmet it'll probably you know sit just out just enough and then you can pull that pull that mask down yep and that's nice it fits so it's designed to fit under any kind of welding hood um, and it is made for the welder well, no, it is a pretty nice mask. The only thing, uh, um, I mean, it fits really nice. I just, uh, you know, if you're not used to wearing a mask, and I, I don't typically wear a mask, but I'll tell you what, that thing, it fits nice underneath your welding hood. Um, but I like it. Any uh, comments or questions or anything? Now, this is a medium size. 
Uh, they come in large, uh, and medium, and small. Uh, medium fits about 75% of the people out there, and this is a medium here. Um, but they're all in stock, they're online, bakersgas.com. If you got any comments or questions, uh, please leave them below and we'll do our best to answer them. And uh, thanks again for watching our video.